Hi, so today I want to chat to you about the importance of building in some reflection time into our day and into our working week. Building in a reflection time, it's a good discipline to get into and it's a really good habit to develop. I'm sure you're all familiar with the, the classic phrase from Abraham Lincoln where he said, if I have eight hours to chop down a tree, I'll spend six hours sharpening the axe. And there's a great lesson to be taken from that. Because if we just jump headlong into stuff and we start sprinting and we start going at a pace, we could be putting in a great effort and that's all very commendable. But if we're going down the wrong road and we're doing it in an inefficient way, it's not the best way of doing it. So when I do work with people in business and in some of my own personal coaching as well, uh, and I would have mentioned this in previous blogs, we do a lot of work around time management and looking at how people are spending their time. So one of the things we always do is we build in that reflection time to make sure we are making the best use of our time and we're focusing on the stuff that really needs to be done. So if you remember from the, the, the last post when we mentioned about the, the time matrix, essentially what reflection time does is it gets you into that quadrant of the not urgent but important work. And that's really, really the key area we need to be spending most of our time. That's where we're planning, we're getting ahead of things, and we're being strategic so that then if something is urgent and important, we do it. But ultimately what we're doing is we're working in a very coordinated way. And if you look at all of the best athletes in the world, one of the key things they do is they build in reflection time and recovery time as part of their routine. And it's important we do that as well as business people and in our personal lives. We have to build in that recovery time where we can reflect and when we can recuperate and regain our energies. So I hope you found that helpful. Developing the habit of building reflection time into our day. And I'm only talking about a few minutes. It doesn't have to be any prolonged period of time, though it's good to do a longer session every now and again as well. But it can be really the difference between us going down the right road at pace versus sprinting down the wrong road and having to reverse back up it and realize we've actually lost some time. So I hope that helps.